Well, here we are, getting ready to uh, do some work on a truck. I'm uh, gonna do the, uh, what's it called, the NorCal wheel mod here. And maybe a few little extras, I'm not quite sure yet. But uh, yeah, since this thing is starting to rust up a bit, it's time to uh, fix it up. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just a little heads up here, what we're gonna be doing inside of here is uh, full coil leaf, Fox Springs, uh, kryptonite upper control arms. Uh, we're going to be replacing the wheel bearing with a uh, kryptonite wheel bearings and tie rod ends also being replaced with uh, kryptonite stead grip. Seals on the side shaft are kind of buggered up so we're going to be dealing with that also and uh, yeah it should be fun. So let's move on over here and see if I can get you set up a little bit on uh, what we're doing. I hope I got a uh, view there so you can see uh, what's going on. And I'll stick my head around and just take a peek. <laughs> now, that's what we got to do here for the wheel mail mod is basically where you see this fold here, there's a bit of a line. So what we want to do is basically just follow up to the inside of that, right down to the corner. Grab a bit of a ruler here, something to uh, make it look somewhat neat. A little easier to uh, see also when trying to cut the bugger. There comes the racket part. And it might not be the right uh, type of hammer, but it'll definitely do the trick. Yeah, this bin in here before was uh, me taking a mallet to it to uh, try and fit the uh, the tires before. Well, what we got to do here is bend this out. too bad at all. I do have a little bit in here that could be used to uh, get a little bit of cut, but let's see if we can maybe break it free. Yep, you got her broke free. Okay, now for the next step here. Uh, I think I gotta bend that a lot further down. Ah, there we go. Oh, it sounds like my wheel well is trying to blow away. 
But the next step here is uh, this strip here needs to be bent over. And in order to do that, we got a little cut in here to do. So I'm going to uh, leave you for a little bit and do a little measuring and uh, we'll be right back with you.